Alright guys, AshBFC here, and welcome back to Shenmue. So now, we need to find the Phoenix Mirror. That, uh, apparently it's somewhere in the house. So let's get on that. We'll chat with the uh, san Um, ine -san? Yes, what is it? Well... About that day, have you remembered anything? No, and I do not want to think about it. I get chills thinking about it even now. Oh. By the way, Fukuhara-san was looking for you. Huh? Fukuhara-san is? Yeah, you see we talked to her right now. She'll tell you that uh, Fukuhara-san is looking for you. Let's go see what he wants. I have to be sure not to waste this. There he is. Fuxa. Huh? Um, Ryo-san, I... What is it, Fuxa? I'm sorry. I told Ine-san. What did you tell her? I told her what you're doing. I told her everything I know. You what? I just couldn't help myself. And Inesan needed to know. Fuxa. I'm really sorry. It's okay. Fuxa, do you know anything about the Phoenix Mirror? The Phoenix Mirror? My father may have had it. No, I've never heard him say anything about a mirror. Really? Inesan might know something about it, though. Okay, let's go ask her. Ah, Inesa. Fukusan talks very loud, doesn't he? Huh? I just heard the two of you talking. We were talking? Yes, I'm sorry. It was rude of me to eavesdrop. Oh, it's okay. No, it wasn't. But then, who could tell the son of Iwao Hazuki to stay out of trouble? I hate to say it, but... I feel like I'm letting your father down. I... I'm sorry for making you worry so much. Dear son, I don't know if this will help or not. But there was one thing I recall. It wasn't that long ago when Azuki sensei went to an antique shop to have something stored for him. My father did what? I don't know what it was, but he said it was very important. Antique shop. Ah, so there you go. Is it the Phoenix Mirror? Let's go find out. Now we should also be able to have a, a little scene with the cat here if we head up to the shrine. You and I have a lot in common. Our parents died on the same day. Ryo! Oh, Nozomi. Ah. What were you talking about? Nothing. You always say nothing. You never tell me anything anymore. It's not like that. It's just... I understand. But you need to talk to me, okay? Okay. Take care of yourself. 
see ya. God damn it, real. Why does he have to be like that? It's very frustrating. He shuts her out. Now, you could actually trigger an event here. This will be available at this point throughout the entire day, so it's very unlikely you're going to miss it unless you know, you're still out beyond curf uh, your curfew. But uh, if you were to head back up the street now, it would trigger. But I'll do it on my uh, way uh, back. But, uh, I love let's see this. if I can get lucky on the capture I should machine. buy one. I think we all know the answer to that. I'll try and the, uh, the virtual fire one this time. I can't remember any of the characters' names. I recognise hmm, them. I know this. But I think this is the first game, isn't it? Which was a Sega Saturn game, yeah? I had one of them on Dreamcast. Maybe I should get another. I don't think they don't make Virtual Fighter games anymore, do they? At least it's not been one for a while. Is it like was the fifth one, the last one? Another friggin' dice. Come on, people. What? This again? I don't know. I'm just as outraged as you are, yo. Maybe I should get another. Maybe we shouldn't. Do you know what I mean? I'll pass. Right, we'll have one crack at the Sonic one. I love these. I'll need to be stopping in at the convenience store anyway, one. down in Dubuita, so I'll, I'll have a crack at the raffle down there. Come on, Robotnik! Give me that Robotnik. I don't know why I've decided I want Robotnik so much, but apparently I do. Who's this? Hmm, I know this. Oh, is it Amy? That's Amy, isn't it? She has it with a hammer. She's just... She's like a darker colour there, isn't she? She's normally quite bright pink. Where was her first appearance? I should try again. For me, it was Sonic Adventure. And she was really annoying. She might have popped up in another one. She might have been in um, Sonic R or uh, Sonic the Fighters. What? This again? Oh, another friggin' Knuckles. What about then another Tails? I should try again. No, no, no. Let's get going. We've got a mirror to find. All right, off we go. I should have gone the other way around so I could pass the uh, convenience store, but oh well. Let's see if I can uh, win a drink. A winning can, sorry. We're going to go with this one. Come on, winning can. God damn it! The game will not give me a winning can, will it? Still don't know what flavour that's meant to be. Ooh. Let me guess, Ryo. Ah, good? Good. Yeah, I thought so. All right, on we go. Can you listen? Christmas music! Shamu does make me feel very Christmassy because, well, I played this game for the first time um, around Christmas. So, it always reminds me of my childhood and being all happy at Christmas because it was my favorite time ever as a kid was Christmas. I loved it so much. Alright, I'll tell you what we're going to want to buy, actually. It's optional, but it's handy, so I'm going to get a light bulb. You'll see why. Yo, may I help you? This. Yes. 
Come again, y'all. Um, I've got yeah, okay, I've got some for the cat. I don't need to buy any cat food. But let's get some. Okay, some more chips. For the sake of getting in the raffle. I would also like a winning ticket, lady. Where's number one, please? Don't give me another five. No prize. Oh, you. Especially since you bought merchandise. Oh, rub it in. I had to trash this entire store. But it's a good job I got things to do. All right, let's get to the antique store. Where is it? This should be the place right here. It's not showing me the name of it, but yeah, there you go. All right, let's see, we got the Phoenix Mirror in here. Excuse me. Oh. That's a delightful sound, don't you agree? It was made especially for that butterfly woman. You know Madam Butterfly, don't you? You, your Hazuki Sensei's... Oh my, that was a terrible thing, your father. Ah. I was holding something at Sensei's request. Hmm, just where did I put it, huh? Oh, yes, it was very important, so I put it here. He'd asked me to polish and look after it for him. For my father? It's given to the Hazuki heirs once they turn 18. I gather this antique has been passed down from generation to generation. Father. If there's anything I can do for you, please let me know. Hazuki Sensei was always there for me when I needed him. Was there anything else that he asked you to hold for him? Anything else? Like a mirror, called the Phoenix Mirror. A Phoenix Mirror? Hmm... Sorry, I don't know of any mirror. Well, that's okay. Thank you very much. Hmm, that's somewhat disappointing. It wasn't a mirror, it was a sword handguard. Anyway, oh, is that the uh, tattooist who just uh, passed me there, isn't it? Nozomi about, there she is. Nozomi. Ryo, let me know if you need any help. Sure. Nozomi. Ryo, take care of yourself. Sure. Sure. Um, let's head back. Hey, bit of jingle bells. Oh, where did Tom go? Well, he moved down to the harbour, didn't he? Hey up, Santa! Um, Merry Christmas! Ho, ho, ho! Pimp! Oh, hello there! 
Get a special Christmas bouquet from Ida Florist for that special someone. Christmas is the time for giving. Ho, ho, ho. Buy your presents at Dobuita's Christmas Sale. Some other time. Oh. Kurita-san. Hey, man, got some really rare stuff in. What kind of stuff? Top quality navy coats and some radical survival gear. There is a lot of fake stuff circulating these days, but we only stock the real thing. I see. Bloody hell, they got taken out there. Well, actually, if we uh, head to the park up here, get a bit extra dialogue we can get. Where is he? There he is. Hey, go in. No, nope, not him. Are you being a good boy for your grandmother? Yep. Good for you. Give her my regards. Okay. See you. Bye bye. Do you, son? Oh, it's you again. What is it? There's something I'd like to ask you. Is it something I might know? It's about the expression, Heaven, Dragon, Earth, Comrade. That's an old legend from Hong Kong. Hong Kong? It is said that in ancient times, there were nine dragons born of Father's Heaven and raised by Mother's Earth to become gods of the Hong Kong Islands. Much revered by the island people, they were considered both parents and comrades, and thus they have remained for eternity. That is the legend. I see. Thank you. There's no need to thank me. Yes, yeah, so there you go. He told him there you can basically, you know, find the meaning behind um, Master Chain's password. Anyway, we're going to head home. Hey, look who's sober. Well done, mate. No way! You're working with Landy? If I was... Why, you... <sighs> okay, what's this all about? If I continue, then I'll fail as your bodyguard. A bodyguard? Father told me to guard you. What? Calm down. If you don't live, it'll be a problem for us. What you mean? You still don't realize your role, do you? If Lan Di gets that mirror, no one can stop him. Hurry and find that mirror. 
before they suspect anything. <laughs> Landy Summer, the Phoenix Mirror? <laughs> Okay, who the hell was that? Or should I say, what the hell was that? We heard someone stalking us. But anyway, as I said, uh, that uh, event there can be triggered at any point during the day. You know, as long as you do it before your curfew, so you'll be very likely going to encounter it. Alright, off we go back home. Books are. Yes? This was at the antique shop for me. Let's see. It's a sword handguard. Yeah. It was my father's. It's a part of my inheritance. I see. Have you seen this before? Like this design? It might be a family crest. Have you asked Inesan? No, not yet. Well, you should ask her. You're right. I think she's in the altar room. Thanks. All right, let's ask uh, any son. This was at the antique shop. A sword handguard. Inesan, do you know anything about this? The snow ring, the two stars, and a sword. That's the Hazuki family crest. And that mirror you're looking for, I wonder if there's a connection. Maybe your father left us a clue. Snow ring, two stars, one sword. Thanks. Okay. Well, what do we do with that? Well, the answer is in the dojo. I do remember the first time I played back in the day, getting a little bit stuck at this point, really not quite sure what it's supposed to do. Oh, we've got this uh, box here on the floor. There's the crest. See? It's the same. So, what does that mean? Well, if you can remember, uh, this mysterious key I got from his dad's room in the... would have been the very first video. Um, that is how we're going to open it. It'll let me. Yeah, it opened. This sword, it has. Alright, 
So we got a sword. Ha! But why is a sword with no handguard in this box? Is if you press A there while facing this way, where I'll do that little thing with the sword. But yeah, why have we got? So with no handguard and the handguard separate. If we have a look at these scrolls here on the wall. Why is that here? What's this oh, slot there for? You go. And then we have a look at this one. That shape, why is that here? It's the crest. Well, I guess it seems obvious what we're meant to do here. Okay. Now, oh, maybe put the sword in this one okay Wow, so it was a switch. Alright, here we go, we're getting somewhere. I wonder where this leads. Interesting, looks like we found a secret basement. Mirror's gotta be down here, right? Now you're actually trying to just walk I need down light here. To go in. Yeah. You can't get in there. Now um let's just head back down there and actually need to come up. You walk back towards the ladder he goes up. Uh if you, I think if you stay down there for a little while and keep attempting to get down there with any light, uh, Fuxan will come and tell you that there's a torch it must be down onto here. the cabinet. Um, but I already picked up the, the torch, so I can't show you that. I actually forgot about that little thing, but it, it's only minus, so I'm not too fussed. I've just done it again, I've gone back up. <laughs> so yeah, you're going to need the torch to um, be able to get down there, basically. It must be down here. Oh. There we go. Alright, let's see what we got down here. It's kind of dark. And uh, your torch is actually on a battery, it will run out. We've got a Maybe light switch the electricity here. Works. If I had a light bulb, it may just work. Yeah. This is why I grabbed a light bulb from the store. Obviously you'd find that out if you come in here for the first time as he says that. But uh let's pop it in there. Now I just need to flip the switch. No shit. There we go. Makes things a little easier. Now, you're most likely going to figure out what you're meant to be doing down here as you sort of look around everything, but if you do spend too much time, it does take a while of just sort of wandering around, not doing anything really. Um, you can get a couple of scenes with a uh, Fuxan, so here's one of them. Ryo-san, 
What is this place? Folksun? I had no idea this was under the dojo. This is where the Phoenix Mirror is? Probably. I'll help you look for it. Thanks. Man, there's an awful lot of stuff here. Wait, what's this? What? These scratches must be from the shells. Oh, I just remembered. I gotta go help Ine-san. Yeah. So yeah. The marks here on the floor. You can also see that uh, if you look at the mirror here. See that little thing stuck on the uh, side there. Um, a few things you can have a look at. It's a paperweight. Keep. I've got a uh, paperweight. It's a really big one, though. It's called an Xbox One. Anyway, um, so look at this. What strange paper? It doesn't look Japanese at all. Where did Father get this? Well, it's kind of Japanese to me. It's this little thing here. Elixir of Eternal Youth. I remember my father telling me about it being used by martial arts experts in China. Where did father get this? Eternal Youth area. Get that smashed down, you. Yeah. I can still use it. So, um, if you've got some matches, which again you can find in the house, it's the, the altar room, right? Or I think you can buy them at the store, you can light some of the candles. It's an alternate method if you haven't got the, um, if actually you've found some matches there. These are all dried out. Oh no, you can't use them. Game teasing you there. Is this? I've never seen a weapon like this. It's one of those throwing things, isn't it? You can use those in the, the Tenchu games. The stab armor? It looks like the name of a move. There you go. That's another uh, move scroll for you right there. Still use it. The candle you can light. There's a few of them knocking about. Hmm, what's that? Hey, it looks like a talisman. What could that talisman mean? Yeah, but that's basically There's a nothing else in that here. shelf at first. I think is it. This drawer, yeah, candle. I can still use it. And you can find candles in the altar room, you can buy them at the store. Candles do burn out as well after a while. They're actually on here. Give a look at this book. Zodiac signs? These are also Chinese. What's this leaf doing here? That's strange. It's not even dry. You can find a white leaf. Interesting. You can also find something um, in here. But if you don't get it now, 
you can get a little extra scene later where you get it, so I'll, I'll save it for that. It's a photo, in case you're wondering. Alright, let's uh, shift this shelf. Right, then we have to look at the marks first. Where's the mirror? These scratches must be from the shelves. There you go. I should get the prompt to move it. see behind it we've got this right here again if you spend a lot of time <laughs> yeah I mean how you're not gonna figure this out I don't know but if you do spend a lot of time and you don't do anything uh, Fuxan will come again and um, point out the different gold wall there so go son Fuxan how's it going you found the Phoenix mirror no not yet oh you've moved the shelves yeah Huh? Strange. What's wrong, Fuxan? This wall. The color's different. Yeah, the color is different. Oh no. This place is creepy. Always get spooked, huh, Fuxan? It's just I... I hate these kind of places. You don't have to stay. I can keep searching. I... if you're sure, then I'm out of here. first huh that wall the color is slightly different so we go over here can I break the wall with this axe well let's give it a whirl see so we grab the axe there Suzuki family crest. This box. Got it. It's the Phoenix Mirror. And there we go. Finally got it. Son, you found the mirror? So that's the Phoenix mirror? It's kinda creepy, eh? I feel like it's pulling me in. Ryo, Ryo san stop it, please! You think it could be cursed? No, I don't think it's cursed. Huh? I have a feeling about it, but I can't explain. Hey, see what I mean? That's dangerous! Are you possessed? Folks, uh, get real, would you? What? I'm serious! Enough. Give me some time alone, okay? Uh, sure. I should take this mirror to Master Chen. Alright. So we got the mirror, we're in business. So yeah, the uh, plan now is to take it down to Master Chen, which I shall do next time. So as always guys, thank you so much for watching, hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you then.